right, guys, welcome back. In today's uh, video and podcast, I'm going to be talking about how to charge more in your soccer training business. Now, I'm going to show you my recipe of doing this, and the way I've done this for years has never changed. All right, so I've, I've you know, kept to this system, uh, and this is the same thing that I want all the people, all the coaches who watch my YouTube videos or podcast or uh, any of our, our online training programs, this system right here works. Um, and number one, this is all gonna come down to your mindset. So the mindset is going to either limit you and, and make you feel like you can only charge a certain amount, or the mindset is going to allow you to raise your prices and start to add more value and create something that is exclusive. It's not for everybody. Um, and that is something, it was really hard for me to overcome that mindset. I would say six and a half years ago, um, and I was stuck at a point, I remember I was charging uh, $60 a session, and I thought that was a lot for parents. Um, and I was just thinking, well man, no one is charging that much in my town. Uh, and so I, feel, I felt like kind of guilty at that point. I always felt like, man, um, am I getting away with something, charging this much for private training? And I started to do a little research online uh, as far as pricing, and not, and not in soccer, but other sports. And I started to see um, other trainers were, were offering way more value than I was for what I was offering my sessions. Um, for basketball, football, or baseball, um, they started to really just add a ton of value to their individual programs. And it made me realize, like, man, if I'm charging $60 a session for what I'm currently offering, like, if I just triple the amount of value that I'm offering in my session, I can easily double or triple my price per session. And that little mindset shift changed everything for me because that made me realize, all right, well, instead of me training 100 kids every month, I could train 20 kids a month and simplify my business in a way where I can limit the amount of people who I'm training, but I can raise the value and I can raise the price of what I'm doing. So this comes down to your mindset. And right now, my program for private training, I have one program right now, it's my highest level program. It's $800 a month, right? And the value that I provide in that program is extreme. Like, and, and I know like people who hear about that program uh, whether it be coaches or parents, they might think that, oh man, that's a ripoff. Like if they just hear the price, they'll, they'll be like, oh, that's way too expensive. But if they start to listen to the value that I provide in that program, to me, for parents who can afford that, who have kids that are committed to it, it's a no-brainer. And I know that because I've been doing that for years now, right? And so this comes down to the mind. If you can open up your mind and know that you need to create more value and you can start to increase your pricing just based on that, then it's limitless. It's limitless to what you can offer. Um, and there's coaches right now who are in my soccer business mastermind. They had they have been stuck for years uh, charging $40 or $50 a session. Now I have them charging $400 a month, $500 a month, because now we start to identify the value that they provide. And now that their mindset has opened up to the new possibilities, like they can be more exclusive with who they want to train now too, which makes the training more enjoyable, it's more fun, it's easier to work with clients who are more serious than a lot of kids who aren't that serious about being there, who aren't that committed, right? So that's number one, right? Number two is you have to have sales skills. If you master that skill and you know how to talk to parents, you know how to listen to parents about what they want and you know who it is you want to help, then once you increase the, the value of your program, you increase the price, it's just about positioning yourself in front of the right parents at that point. And knowing how to talk to them, knowing how to communicate with them, to me is so key. And that's something I'm still looking to improve on. Um, if you met me eight years ago, like, I would never create these videos. I would never, uh, I would hate talking to parents over the phone. Like I was scared of that. But because I've talked to parents, I've, I've really pushed myself outside of my comfort zone. I used to force myself to go out to the field every Saturday, every Sunday for multiple hours and I would talk to parents and I started to break out of my shell that way. And that way, like when it came time to, uh, for me to sell something over the phone to parents, they needed to trust me over the phone. They needed to like me, they needed to know about me, right? And these are things, all right, I'm gonna dig into in a, in a future video um, coming up, 
but you have to have that skill of selling. And if you don't have it, you need to learn it, right? That's very, very key. Um, the next thing that's going to allow you to charge more is the demand of your program. So that just simply means, like, are all your spots taken? Or do you have a wide open schedule? If you have a wide open schedule, it's gonna feel pretty weird trying to sell something uh, that's really expensive um, if other players aren't in your program or if there's, there's no other players who've gone through your program that have gotten results, right? Which leads me to my last thing is the results of the players who've gone through your program, to me, justifies how valuable you are. And for me, in our program here, we've trained over 5,400 kids now. Um, and that's been over a long period of time. And that's been through private training, group training, camps, clinics, every type of training you can think of we've offered and the number one thing that I can rely on that and I can go to sleep at night with a clear mind is knowing that the results that we have with kids have been bar none like supreme in my city so we've helped tons of kids get to college we've helped tons of kids from rec soccer get to, to club soccer we've helped tons of kids that get zero playing time to being captain on their team. The results is everything. And if you can establish that you're the authority on achieving those results with players, then you raising your price is something you have to do. It's a smart thing to do. And if you're just stuck selling one price right now, you don't know how to talk to parents, you, you feel like you wanna grow your business and, and you're just kind of stuck right now, I want you to reach out to me this week. Um, the best way to do that is simply go to my website, go to www.soccerentrepreneur.com there's a big blue button at the top of the homepage. Uh, from there, you can click on that. That's going to set up a free strategy call with you and me. Uh, it'll be 10 to 15 minutes. Uh, we're gonna chat on the phone. I'm gonna see how I can help you out. Um, so go ahead, take advantage of that. It's completely free. Um, so just go to our website. It's www.soccerentrepreneur.com. Like I said, the big blue button at the, the home screen, click on that. Very easy application process there. Um, and I would love to talk to you this week. Thanks for watching our video. Subscribe to our YouTube channel here and make sure and subscribe to our iTunes podcast. We have around 100 podcasts right now that are already available. Um, you can go and check those out whenever you want. Um, a lot of coaches um, prefer that over video, so go check that out if you haven't yet and subscribe there as well. All right, I'll see you soon.